Hi, my name is Carlos Ochoa, and I'm about to go through step one of the mini tub method with you. This is when we mix our spores with our grains. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is to grab all your sterilized quart sized grain jars. And we always use sterilized whole oats. The next thing you're going to want to do is grab your spore syringe. Now make sure you get spores from someone you trust. Now shake that spore syringe. There are going to be little black dots floating in the liquid. Those are spores, and there are thousands of them in each syringe. The next thing you're going to want to do is to wipe down that injection port on the grain jars with an alcohol swab. Next, you're going to want to put the hypodermic needle on the syringe. Please be careful, the needle is quite pokey. Remove the sheath from the needle and wipe the needle down with the alcohol swab. Inject two cc's into each jar. That might not seem like a lot, but you only need two spores to grow mycelium and grow mushrooms. Now roll the grains around, but be gentle with them. Now repeat the process with the remaining grain jars. I like to add the initials of the mushroom species that I'm trying to grow, and then write the date that I completed step one. That's it, now it's time to wait. Put the jars back in the mini tub and wait for about two weeks. Keep them between 75 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Follow us for step two or visit happylittlefungi.com for more information. Or just drop a question in the comments.